axis. Mm -hmm. uh, his eyes are not balls, they're cylinders. So I'm certain whatever the focus on the back of his retina is, it's probably quite different from how you and I perceive the world. Mm -hmm. And they hunt with their ears. Mm -hmm. Now, if you're flying around at night, you got to see where you're going so you don't crash into a tree. But they oh, actually yeah. they actually hunt with their ears. As I told you, he could hear our hearts beating. He could hear a mouse scrabbling through the leaves. Okay. And the really cool thing about owl ears is, unlike all other eared animals in the world, who all have perfectly symmetrical ears, mirror image, right? An owl has one ear that points a little bit right, a little bit up, and a little bit forward and a little bit left, a little bit back, and a little bit down, or some species it might be the opposite. But either way, with only two ears, they're pointing their ears in all directions. And they're not located in the same spot on their head either. One's a little bit more forward than the other ear hole. And the result of that is, you know how when you and I are trying to locate a sound, we'll either locate it as to being mm -hmm. to the left or being to the right. Mm -hmm. Well, when an owl's facing in such a direction that the sound hits both ears at exactly the same time, the owl is looking exactly at the source of the sound, whether or not he can see it. And he can pounce and land right where the source of the sound was coming from. And that's why they hunt with their ears. Unfortunately, this little guy has got permanent nerve damage to the whole left mm -hmm. side of his head, which is why only one side of the feathers stick up. If you look at his eyes closely. It's harder mm -hmm. to see in this light, but sometimes the light is such that you can see that his left iris is kind of crinkled, because his iris is a muscle. The muscle has atrophied. Um, he, his, his beak actually grows faster on the right side than it does on the left, and he oftentimes displays vertigo. The balance mechanism is inside your ear. So if he's got trouble with the balance mechanism, he probably also has hearing loss. Mm -hmm. And even if he can hear accurately where the prey is moving, mm -hmm. he probably can't hit it when he pounces on it because of the mm -hmm. vertigo. And that's why he lives with us. Mm -hmm. Other than that, he's perfectly healthy. He's very strong. His wings are quite strong. When he decides he's going to fly away from me, he takes to my hand with him. <laughs> it's amazing mm -hmm. how much torque you can get out of such a small pair of wings. <laughs> Maria did a good job on your beak yesterday, buddy. That's a good-looking beak. I haven't mm -hmm. seen it look that good in a long time. We had a specialist come in to trim them up yesterday. Oh. But that kind of tent fly. You'd never see them in the tree. Never see them in the tree. No, you wouldn't. 